What's going on, you guys? It's your boy Joseph with Hood Fishing, man. I hope everybody doing good today. Today, we're going to try to go do some bluegill and catfish today, man. So, I'm going to go hit up one of my spots. I usually go catch some nice bluegills and cats. So, let's get ready for this. Y'all just get ready. All right, we're back, man. I'm out here at a nice little spot. Water, water look pretty decent. I'm about to try to see if, some, if we can catch some nice cats, some bluegills. This is why I normally come to catch them. <clears throat> I'll kind of show y'all something too because when we get closer down here to this water, you can see how close up it is from here to the, to the ground. I see bass right now, bluegills. But if you look further out, it's a little drop right off that cliff where you rocks is, where you look. And it drops pretty deep. I say maybe about 15, 20 feet. So, but man, there's some nice blue, blue gills in here, some nice catfish. So we're gonna try to give it a shot. See what we can come up with. So y'all just stay tuned. Cause it's about to get nasty. Let's hook up. All right, guys, I was hooked up, and this blue gear just ran underneath a rock, so I got to try to get them out now. There we go. They all stirred up over here on the bank. Pretty good, man. I see some giants coming up out of there. That's a decent. Not quite what I'm looking for. Pretty decent. Yeah, when they come to panfish, man, I don't keep them all, but if I come across something nice, I go ahead and get it. I'm going to go ahead and let this guy go. Alright, let's go get some more. Alright, your boy's back on the scene, man. Been, uh, been out here for a couple of hours trying to catch these bluegill. They're kind of slow, but they finally picking up. It's kind of a smaller one. I just caught him. That's my nice size one in here, though. Let's see what I'm working with. And the crazy part, you guys, I'm using bread. I'm not using no lead, just straight weightless. I'm letting that thing just float down on the hook. They're killing it every time. I'm gonna let this baby go here. Yeah. Keep it rolling, baby. There's plenty more of these guys out here, so it's like a whole little bed right up in this little area. So I'm just gonna uh, we just gonna keep the motion going. All right, your boy's on again. Nice size, man. Nice size. Starting to come up and hit. That's just a little average size. Not really big to compare compared to the ones I already caught, but we're gonna go ahead and keep them. We're in the mount right now, man. Let's keep it going. That's a 
better one, y'all. It's a nice one right here, baby. That's a nice one, though. Like I said, man, it's kind of shallow right there. There's a little point right off that little edge, if you can see down in there. And it's just straight drop, man. I'm just tossing it in there. They just coming up to get it like crazy. Still on it, baby. Let's go. Just so y'all can see what's going on real quick. Right here. That's just a regular white thread. And I'm just slapping it. That joke on the hook. That's it. Squish it up too hard. Just all up a little bit. started doing when I first started going fishing. When I used jigs and worms and all that good stuff. This right here is like the secret ingredient. <laughs> I decided to do a little bit of bank fishing today, man. Chase me some giant bluegill. I seen some big catfish in here, but it don't seem like they really want to fight today. I'm back, y'all. Had to make a few adjustments with the camera. I'm just gonna sit there so y'all just put it there. Just a second. I even really smashing it on that too much, but that's all I'm putting on it. I gotta grab the back of them gears, man, because they so sharp. You gotta lay them down. Gotta still lay them down, man. You don't want to get stuck by those, but see, that's a beautiful, beautiful gear over there, man. Y'all see what I'm working with.
For anybody that love bluegills, y'all know what I'm talking about, man. <laughs> pan size, pan size. trick on them sometimes, sometimes they playing a the trick on you. <laughs> you fish are smart though. Baby, uh, with that hook. I don't want to hurt him. Go back so he can throw some hook. Catch him again. Got my hook line down here, man. That thing pretty tight. Pause for a second, cause I need to see what this is. Y'all just stay tuned, man. It's your boy Joski. Well, boys, we done wrapped it up for the day. Caught some decent, nice slabs, man. Got to take these home and clean them up. Missed a lot of good bites. I'm not gonna even lie about that, but uh, it's all good. I'm not even really disappointed. At the end of the day, I caught him. We found what we was looking for. We got the job done, semi. <laughs> so it's your boy Joski, man. I'm out. Got a few things I need to go handle for the day. So see you guys soon. Peace.